our quote around here is, the land owns you, you don't own the land. This is the most incredible plant on the planet. This is actually medicine. I've seen the healing. I can't turn my back on that. Voters legalize the recreational use of marijuana. We, we are the Bud sisters. sisters. We did that so good. <laughs> I'm a second-generation cannabis farmer. My dad would say things like, make sure you don't tell anybody. I have owned two restaurants in New York City. My goal in the cannabis industry is to support the small family farmers. Thank you for being a part of this incredible journey of a lifetime. Our dispensary will be geared to the needs of seniors. Hi, my name's Felicia. I am a LGBT and cannabis advocate and activist. Is getting legal getting harder? Plants don't have office hours. <laughs> Do something that scares you every day. You have to learn how to be bold and stand up for yourself. Small pot farmers say the state is not standing by its promise to protect them. If that doesn't happen, we'll be there to confront whoever it is we need to. Big business is barking all around our heels right now. And they're more skilled and they've got more money. Only the strong will survive. This is a nightmare. Well, I had a panic attack. <laughs> when you do all you could do and you still get a no. Are you willing to go to jail and lose everything? I'm dying to fight this just because of the social injustice of it. If we got one person out of prison whose family life was ruined. Yeah, yeah. that would be nice. <laughs> but get that piece of the pie back that was robbed from us. We're pioneers at this point. Don't let anything stop you. Love you, Mama.